Hey guys, it's me, Sarah, and welcome to my YouTube channel. I just woke up, so sorry for my crazy hair. So today, um, we're going to talk about 9-11. Happy 9-11, and we're also going to talk about relationship and the truth about relationship and why you, should, why you should speak up in a relationship with your partner or with your family or whoever you're with because um, if you don't, and you keep quiet, and you never say anything in a relationship, then in the end, you're going to be depressed, you're going to be suicidal, you're going to have mixed feelings, and everything bad is going to happen to you. So you should always speak the truth of how you feel, no matter if it hurts. And on 9-11, an airplane crashed into a building and killed a bunch of people. And people have died, and um, also a bomb, like an airplane bomb, also like hit a building. I was just a little girl, so I can't remember like all of what happened, but um, I just pray and hope, and you know, for the families who lost their loved ones in this uh, 9 11. Um, I know it's a tragic day, and I know some people are, you know, devastated and grieving about it still, but I just hope for the best on this day and hope people overcome this day and um you should always speak the truth with your partner your family you should always you know talk to one another be honest be loyal have faith always communicate with your partner always trust yourself and your partner and if you have a gut feeling or you feel like some, something's bothering you or something's not working out, then you should speak the truth of how you feel with someone. If you don't, you're going to be depressed. <clears throat> Sorry. <clears throat> Sorry, I'm getting a cold. I'm just getting over a cold. And so, um, yeah, so that's why I'm kind of losing my voice at the same time. And so... Um, Anyway, so I hope you guys have a good day and um, the relationship should start with a positive attitude, positive attitude. You should always be texting and communicating and calling one another. You should always stay strong, have a good mindset, speak the truth and speak from your heart and your gut and your soul and your mind and just tell the honest truth, even if it hurts you, even if it's a lie. You, you should speak the truth, even if it was a lie, is what I meant to say. Because if you don't speak the truth of whatever happened, then it'll come back to you and hit you in the face. And you'll be sorry, and you'll regret it. And God doesn't like liars, and God doesn't like people who hide from them, from themselves and others. You should always open your mind and speak how you feel. If it's positive, good. If it's negative, then that's all on you. I can't control it. Each and everyone's emotions. P people have emotions. People have feelings. People feel the way they want to feel. If you feel that way, then you should speak to someone about it. Or you should get counseling. Or you should talk to someone close about it. Um, Pray and worship. Go to church. Read the Bible. Listen to um, worship music gospel music listen to christian music that can help you even like um podcasts like relationship podcasts can even help you um speaking with your partner speaking with your partner's family speaking to yourself taking notes and taking thoughts of you know his actions and your actions and what you believe and what he believes and you know understanding each other's beliefs and feelings is the way you should understand each other in a relationship. So um, you should always communicate with each other, number one. Always trust each other, number two. Always have faith with each other, number three. Always have hope with each other, number four. Always have loyal loyalty, honesty, faith, communication, and always speak your mind on how you feel. And happy 9-11, and thank you for watching. If you have any questions, comments, or concerns, please leave them down below. And thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, and have a good day.